sponsored by 666bet.com. Cooking Cassis for Eiffel TV in association with Macklin's Gym Marbella and 666bet. We're at the XL Arena here with me. I've got trainer Jimmy Tibbs. Well, this must be one of your best nights, Jim, as a trainer. Yeah, it is. Yeah, it's a good night. I mean, very hard fight. Um, both men were very fit. It was a grueling fight. Um, about the right decision, split decision, but he knew he got beat and Joe knew he won. Uh, but saying that, it was a very hard fight. And uh, I admire the kids the way he came in. But he left that kid, leaves himself open for a lot of shots. And uh, if there's a next time, things could be a lot different. Was what you got from Chris Eubank Jr. what you expected from Chris Eubank Jr. tonight in the ring, Jim? Yes, I expect I got what I expected, but I'll be quite honest with you, and I'm not putting my man down, but I expected a little bit more than Joe mm. with that left cross. He didn't hardly use his left cross. Uh, jab, hooks and that, but he, you know, it, when he did use it a couple of times early rounds, he shook him up. So, you know, but he didn't use it because it's all like me talking. I mean, when you're in that ring, it's hard. He was uh, waiting for Joe to step in so he could chuck a left up, uh, a right up, a cut. All them things, you know, boxing about with one another. But um, he made him miss a lot. Joe made him miss a lot. And, um, you know, we're happy about the result. That's the main thing. How much of a key factor was Billy Joe's experience at this level, the rounds he's done, the opponents he'd faced, well, that's what made compared him that's what to Cushy Bank? That's what made him the winner. The experience, see? That kid coming out, see that kid coming out with, with respect or something about the kid, he put up a great fight tonight. But if he's ever in there with a big, big puncher, he's in trouble because he's wide open. But it's not for me to deflate him or anything, he's done well. We come again, that kid, and uh, he put up a wonderful fight, a good fight. I'm very pleased to work with him, the other team. Who's hugely likely that Billy Joe will fight for, for a world title? At some point next year, Jim. Which so you'll have, um, well, yeah, that must make Korobov you happy. Yeah, or, uh, or Andy, Andy Lee. Lee. Yeah. The, the winner of that. Yeah, that must make you happy that you know. Oh yeah, it's going to be a good Christmas. I mean, it's yeah, you know, it's sad someone's got to lose in a fight like that. But with you know, he, he always finds a way. Billy Joe does. Always yeah. finds a way. Yeah, and uh, I mean, it's not one of his best fights. I'm yeah. telling you now, and we all know that yeah. he can box a lot better than that. He just didn't throw enough. Bang, bang, crack, left cross, didn't yeah. do it. I said, Joe, you got to do it. And when he did do it, he shook him. Mm. But he got drawn in. But he's, you know, he got drawn in. Uh, he was getting caught with the referee, let the other kid get away with a lot of infringements, punching behind the back of the head. But he still found a way to clip the clean shots in, the clean shots that won in the fight. Mm. But saying that it was a great fight, and, uh, and uh, I'll just say, uh, like, well done to the two of them. All right, well, listen, Jimmy Tibbs, thanks for giving us a little bit of your time and thanks for your time throughout the whole build up, really. It's been brilliant. Thank you very much, Jimmy Tibbs. You're welcome. Thank, Thank you. you. The Big Fight, sponsored by 666bet.com.